here. Y'all make sure y'all hit that thumbs up button, you heard? Hey, it's a couple people on here. I might leave this live up. You know what I'm saying? I might leave this joint up. But this is what I want to say, right? If you or anybody else, you know what I'm saying, talks about somebody that suffer from mental health issue, that mean motherfucking that person could commit suicide at any time. All right? So a person who has mental health issues, you don't just continuously keep bringing that person down because all of the hurting and the you this and you that xyz i i i all of that all that does is take a person to push them to that point to where they will commit suicide you feel what i'm saying so i i just want to say this to y'all you know what i mean like if y'all got anybody that's suffering from mental health like go easy on them you know what i'm saying because if that motherfucker's suffering and you just dragging on them, you don't know what that person going to do. You feel me? So sometimes you got to just understand and, and, and relax. You know what I'm saying? You just just stop stop putting that person in in the deeper. Like you, like you just helping motherfucker dig their own grave. Like, you know what I'm saying? You got to understand that's what you're doing. You know what I'm saying? So... For me, everybody that's having a, having, that has somebody or you suffering from mental health issues and you want to push your shit back, you got to understand, bro, like, you can't be around people who are basically encouraging you to do that shit. You know what I'm saying? Because at the end of the day, that's what it is. If a motherfucker keep on... If you got a real problem and a motherfucker just keep pushing you and pushing you and pushing you, that motherfucker wants you to motherfucker kill yourself, bro. You feel me? And, and if they not if they not doing nothing to help you, so what they'll do is they'll try to tell you that you supposed to help yourself, but sometimes you might need family to help, bro. Like, you feel me? Like you might need family to help. You might need motherfuckers to come through and just be there for you. You know what I'm saying? So just. You know what I'm saying? On, on the mental health tip, bro, y'all just remember, man, like, don't push a nigga to the limit, man. Don't push a bitch to the limit. Just try to be understanding and and, and try to help. You know what I'm saying? Because if you're not helping, then you, you you making the situation worse, man. That's just real talk, man. Straight up. Y'all on this motherfucker, y'all make sure y'all hit that thumbs up button. You know what I'm saying? Hit that thumbs up button. You know what I'm saying? Because... Cause, 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 cause they tell me I'm suffering from, I got mental health issues. That's what they telling me. You know what I'm saying? Like, I got mental health issues and I'm just like, well, damn. I thought I would have been had mental health issues five, six years ago. How the fuck all of a sudden I got it now? You know what I mean? So, you know, I'm a, I'm a motherfucking strong ass nigga, man. I go through so much shit, bro. I get hurt by so many people and I still, I'm still here, bro. Like I still... Get on this motherfucker and fuck with y'all niggas. I still try to do the best I can do to take care of my family. You feel me? But, you know, Weezy got mental health issues. And it's like, all right, well, goddamn, where the fuck this shit come from? But, you know, hey, it is what it is. But stop trying to motherfucker make me motherfucker put that motherfucker to my shit and blow my noodles loose. You feel me? Stop, stop trying to put me to that point to do that because... At the end of the day, you're not trying to help the situation if that's what it is with me. So I'm going to just speak off of what these motherfuckers are saying about me. You know what I'm saying? I'm going to speak on what they're saying about me. And maybe, maybe I can help somebody else. You feel me? So if you're a motherfucking nigga, you want to push your shit back, bro. It's, listen, bro. We all go through shit. Everybody hurt, bro. Everybody angry. That's life, man. Don't never let a motherfucker... Don't never let a motherfucker tell you that you wrong for being hurt. You dig what I'm saying? Don't never let nobody say that to y'all, man. Real talk. You ain't wrong for being hurt. Nobody wrong for being hurt. Male, female, nobody. Nobody, bro. You feel me? 
Don't let a motherfucker tell you that shit, dog. He did what I'm saying. You feel me? Like I'm just being 100 with you, man. Don't don't let nobody tell you that you wrong for being hurt, bro. You dead? So, shit. I listen. I ain't know I had mental health issues, but shit. All my motherfucking close ones is telling me I do. You know what I'm saying? All my close ones telling me I do. So, uh, damn. I guess I'm fucked up. You hear me? So, shit, I don't know, bro. You know what I mean? I don't know. You know what I'm saying? Real nigga shit, man. <clears throat> Real nigga shit. But help that motherfucker, man. Nigga ain't right, bro. Do what you got to do to help that nigga, man. Straight up. Do what you got to do to help him. It ain't, it ain't a situation where you turn your back on him or, or anything. Help that motherfucker, man. Shit, help him. And a lot of times what people what people tend to do is people don't know how to hold themselves accountable for fuck shit that they do. So when fuck shit come back, then it's like, ah, why you do that? Like, but it's like, bro, you've been doing fuck shit the whole time to me. You know what I'm saying? He been doing fuck shit the whole time to her. She been doing fuck shit the whole time to him. So you can't be, you can't feel like, you know what I'm saying? I feel like to me, that's more some mental health shit. You know what I'm saying? If if we want to, I, I don't, I don't really know what mental health is. Like, I don't know. But I do know wrong and right. And I do know that in the court of law, you, you, you're only either guilty or in, innocent. You dig? So, I don't know, man. I just, I just felt, you know what I'm saying, like I had to say that to y'all because, you know what I'm saying, they, they say I'm, I, I'm, I'm suffering from mental health issues. <clears throat> and I'm just like, nigga, what the fuck? I don't, I don't know. But okay, don't try to run me into the ground and motherfucker push my shit back if that's really what it is. And for people who really are on the page of pushing their shit back, find somebody and go holler at a, a random nigga. Go holler at a random nigga on the streets and get some advice from him. If you always going to one of your closest partners or your closest uh, family member, and they just keep making you be like a fucked up person, go holler at a nigga that don't know you. Go holler at a motherfucker, a, a bitch that don't know you from a can of paint, and you holler at them and get your sanity back. You know what I'm saying? Get your sanity back. It's jealousy in so many people, and so many people is jealousy. You know what I'm saying? It's jealousy in so many people, so when you be thinking like you actually talking to a motherfucker, who really gonna be there for you? It's it, they got jealousy with them shit. You know what I mean? So man, you already know, man. You know what I'm saying? No cap. No cap. And for every action is a reaction. Always remember that. For every action is a reaction. You can't do fucked up shit to people and don't expect fucked up shit to come back. For every action is a reaction. You know what I'm saying? Remember that, man. I always knew I was wrong with seat. I don't know what with seat mean, but I definitely understood you saying you always knew you was wrong. That's the biggest part. Like when a motherfucker don't know they wrong, that's when a nigga really got a problem. Zeus! That's when a nigga really got a problem when they don't know they wrong. Do I use it? No. Wow, what's wrong? Cause what? When? Oh, you gotta ask her now. You can't ask her.
You say she said send the link. What the fuck is the damn link for the door that? I don't, I don't know no door that thing. Huh? I don't know either. That's what I'm saying. I don't I don't know no door. I don't go there when you put the address in. You put the address in, then you pay for it. Is it a top for this joint? Huh? Where's that? On the table. That nigga being extra as shit, ain't he? Who, you and Zeus? I ain't calling you, boy. Rod, what it do, Rod? Oh. You a beat your ass. Who is this? Bitches a beat your ass. Who are you talking about? Bitches a beat your ass. What the fuck is this? I got 20,000. I beat the bricks off of him. You a beat your He's a good man, Savannah. A good man. He's just in a bad situation right now, and he's trying to get out of it. Why are you hugging like that? <laughs> <laughs> So one of them steaks is yours, yeah? Zeus, what's good with you, dog? Damn. Hey, one more time. For every act, for every action, it's a reaction. Always understand that, man. You can't cross a motherfucking nigga or a bitch. And 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 expect for something not to happen. Back. For every action, it's a reaction, man. Whether y'all youngins or y'all older, just understand for every action is a reaction. You can't, you can't, you know what I mean? You can't just expect to fuck a motherfucker over and, and don't nothing happen back to you. You know what I'm saying? For every action, it's a reaction, man. The real life. The only motherfucking person I got in my motherfucking life that's going to have my back is my father. You feel me? My father, the only motherfucker that's going to have my back. My father, the only person that's going to be there for me. I don't have nobody else. When I'm in the jam and I'm broke as a bitch, I got. I call my father. My father, he going to come through for me. You feel me? That's so, so far. You know what I mean? Just know, you can't fuck a nigga over. You can't fuck a bitch over and, and, and just expect, you know, it's just going to all be good. You got to always expect something to come back. For every action is a reaction. Y'all remember that. For every action, it's a reaction. Real nigga shit, man. So like I say, for, for everybody who, who, who actually, you know, really suffers from mental health, listen, man, if you're dealing with people who are pushing you to that point to feel like that you about to push your shit back, don't even deal with them folk, bro. You hear me? Like, don't even deal with them folk, bro. Little duty, duty back in town. You feel me? Duty then came from New Orleans. You know what I'm saying? Duty in, Duty in Maryland right now. You feel me? So, you just got to be around love, bro. Surround yourself around people who actually care about you. And that's the hardest thing for us black men to do. You feel me? Surround yourself around people who love you. You did? That's the whole thing. The whole thing, dog. Surround yourself around people who love you. 
you surround yourself around people who love you, bro, you ain't going to miss a beat. You ain't going to miss a beat when you surround yourself around people who love you. When you put yourself, and it's not even positive. You know how motherfuckers, like, the new, the new saying right now is the vibes, the energy, negative energy. Man, fuck all that. Listen, surround yourself around people who love you. Because when you surround yourself around people who love you, you're not going to lose. When you surround yourself around people who don't look, don't love you, you're going to lose. You feel me? Like, I'm doing this shit right now. You know, normally this is a before the video start. You know what I'm saying? Like, nah, I put this in the motherfucking title. So I'm going to tap in on this joint. You know what I'm saying? Like, you know what I mean? I'm not going to just give a little minute, a little minute clip, and then boom, let's start this video. Like, you know what I'm saying? I'm actually talking to y'all niggas, man. Real tough. I'm actually talking to y'all niggas. Rod say we the same age. Yeah, already. Midwest say hit that like button. Midwest say hit that like button, man. Put a nigga in the algorithm. You heard. You can't fuck a nigga over. You can't hurt a nigga and, and then just expect that, like, oh, well, I, that's just what I did. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, shit don't work like that, man. Shit don't work like that. You you gotta accept what the fuck comes with the fuck shit you do. I've been accepting that shit my whole life. You know what I'm saying? I do some bad man shit to a motherfucker, and there's some bad man shit helping happen to me. I don't be crying about that shit. I be blown. I be blown like shit. But at the end of the day, I deal with that shit. All my fucked up situation, bro. Like y'all gotta think about this shit. As long as y'all been watching me. What the fuck good has been going on in my life? There's nothing good in my life since y'all been watching me. It's back to back to back to back to back to back bullshit. It's back to back to back to back to back to back drama. It's back to back to back to back to back police shit. You feel me? So, like, I'm a poster child, man. I wasn't here. I wasn't put on earth to be happy. I was put on earth to be an example. You feel me? What Jay-Z said, Hove did that, so hopefully you wouldn't have to go through that. But see, Jay-Z ain't talk to y'all niggas. I talk to y'all niggas. You heard? I talk to y'all niggas, man. I look at me, and, and, and everything I do, everything I do, make that something. Nah, yeah, I done seen boss man go through that. Nah, I'm, nah, I'm cool on that shit. You know what I'm saying? Like, real nigga shit, man. Real nigga shit. Real nigga shit. <laughs> you feel me? But we gonna we gonna we gonna keep doing we gonna keep doing what we do. We gonna keep being fly. We gonna keep motherfucking getting fresh, and we just about to be fucking a bunch of bitches. You know what I'm saying? That's really what the fuck we about to be on. So the new journey about to be coming, and it's about to be very 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 vicious. You heard? Very vicious, man. No cap. No cap. But anybody, again, Anybody that is feeling like, you know, they, they want to kill themselves, man, listen, if you can't get that help from a family member or a friend, I promise you, go holler at a stranger. A stranger on the street don't, like I say, don't know you from a can of paint. So that stranger on the street is going to definitely be honest with you versus a family member or a friend who know you. You know what I'm saying? That already has their opinion about you. Like when a person, when a person already has an opinion about you or they painted a picture of you, you never gonna win. You're never gonna win. When a person has an opinion or painted a picture about you, you're never gonna win. You feel me? You're never gonna win. You feel me? So you just just go hide, let somebody that don't know you. 
You know what I'm saying? <laughs> How let somebody that don't know you from a can of paint, y'all? They gonna tell you what it is. They gonna let you know if you right or you wrong. Cause they don't know you. What they got to lose? Motherfucker don't know you. What they got to lose? Nothing. Cause they don't know you. Motherfucker don't know you. So holler at a motherfucker that don't know you, bro. Like, cause motherfuckers in your circle, you never really know. You know, you never really know, you know, what a motherfucker there for. You know what I'm saying? You ever think about how you had motherfuckers? Everybody done had this shit. Motherfuckers done turned on you. Motherfuckers done crossed you. You know what I'm saying? Motherfuckers done lied to you, stole from you. You go meet a motherfucker that don't know you from a can of paint, bro. They don't have no intentions on doing none of that shit because there's nothing for them to gain because they don't know you. So, hey, man. Straight like that, man. Make sure y'all hit that thumbs up button. You know what I'm saying? Make sure y'all hit that thumbs up button. And, 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 and like Rod say, keep God first. Keep God first. Keep God first, you heard? I got some motherfucking, uh, I got some good old motherfucking, I got some mixed vegetables going on right here. I got that steak right there. Let me see, that motherfucking steak, mm. That steak, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Boom, bang, wing, bam, thank you, ma'am. I got one fucking pot, so. I really, I got, I can't do too much because I got one fucking pot. But you know what I mean? Got this mixed vegetables going on. You know what I'm saying? Got this good old steak. My dumb ass motherfucker forgot the. Uh, I forgot. Uh, I don't even know what the fuck them shits is called, but I forgot that shit. So I'm gonna have to take that out. And use this one pot to make the macaroni because it's only one pot. So that's what I'm gonna have to do. Make that mac and cheese, that good old motherfucking broccoli, mixed vegetables. You did? Yeah. There ain't no paprika in here. Where the fuck the paprika at? Oh, there it go right there. I found it. I ain't got that much seasoning either. But I make it do, I make I make it do what it do. On phone them gray, huh man? I make it do what it do. Dang. Damn, bro, why you acting? I ain't, I ain't called you. This is my first time calling you all damn day. Like, why you acting like I'm bothering you? Huh? All right, like you act, like every time I, like I call you two times and I, yes. Like what the, I ain't, what the fuck, nigga? I ain't, I ain't been bothering you all day, shorty. What's good with you? Girl, don't you do that? Don't you wait till I walk away, daddy. Daddy, daddy, daddy. What you talking about? Yo, as well. I was just about to ask you, do you want some motherfucking uh, more macaroni or no? I'm not about to go back to the store and buy no snacks. So you might as well cancel that. 
Cancel that, my love. Look here, one story. Yeah, I'm I'm doing good, man. How you doing tonight? Nigga just cooking. That's all the nigga doing right now. Just cooking. You feel me? Just cooking. Just cooking. Nah, that ain't that ain't motherfucking that ain't Christina. That's motherfucking stink ass. That's my daughter. That ain't Christine. That's my daughter doing that shit. Motherfucker always <laughs> acting like motherfucker be bothering her and shit. Nigga, I, I only I only talked to her two days. I mean two times a day. With, well, four times a day when I woke her, when I went upstairs to make sure her ass was up to go to school. And before I left to go to the store and when I just, when y'all just heard me say something to her. Like, nigga, I don't be bothering your ass, nigga. You be in the room barricaded. The fuck? That's that fucking teenager shit. I don't like, I don't be knowing about this shit. This shit be weird. I don't be know what the fuck be going on with Shorty sometimes. Like Shorty be in just her, her own new world. I don't fucking know. It is what it is, though. I guess that's a part of uh, being a teenager. You know what I'm saying? Gotta, I guess I got to deal with it. I guess I got to learn how to start dealing with shit and, 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 and not thinking that I can solve shit. I don't fucking know. But goddamn me, nigga, I ain't done nothing to your motherfucking ass. The fuck is you upset with me for? You hear me? <laughs> you hear me? Like, <laughs> look here one story hell man you still gotta have an escobar hey look i gotta hey listen i'm gonna tell you hey hey look hey 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 look here one story I'm about to go. I got to go back to having Escobar dreams. You hear me? Yeah. Nigga got to go to motherfucking really trying to, yeah. That thug life, I'm about that. Close range, I pop something. Talking money, that's my lane. Oh boy, bro. Tell him stop front. Ride around with that pistol on me. Smoke one for my nigga. Oh, go hard, go hard for OG Fresh. Call me every day when I was on the road. I'm a hundred nigga. You ain't got to like me. Still got my AK. Free boo, free beat just a little cut and do the big cut and fizzle. Talk to me that was last night. My thug got it out West Bank. Shorty, you can put your panties on. Can't fuck with you because your pussy stank. I move pounds on everything. Got four cues, three different niggas. Stupid fresh. Kodak Weezy. Tell your baby mama come take a picture. I know that you know that I got money, so you got to hate. Break a pound down, I make 10000 off it any day. Work, work, work. You ain't my money? Boy, you tripping. Shit, I'm racked up and I'm balling by the money trap. My shit stay jumping. Yeah, man. I'm, I'm trying to have them Escobar dreams too, bro. You heard? <laughs> For real. Rod say, stay on here, big bro. So, D say, would you start back wearing the watches? I right, man, listen. Realistically, because, <clears throat> you know, I was a flashy. I was a flashy nigga. Like, it wasn't just me being flashy with clothes. I was flashy with the jewelry. 
Um, I feel like when I'm able to spend, you know, like 20, 30, and 30,000 and that shit don't bother me. Yeah, I'm gonna be back on that jury shit. When I can spend 20, 30 and that shit ain't nothing on jury, then yeah, I'll be back wearing that shit. That that'll be coming soon. Watch, trust and believe. Trust and believe. That shit could be coming, that shit gonna be coming back soon. You dig? I'm I'm my I'm putting the grill back in my mouth and everything. I'm getting the grill, all that. I'm doing everything. Oh, I'm going. I'm start. I'm start. I'm going back to the basics. You know what I mean? I'm putting the grill in my mouth. I'm gonna do the air range, the jewelry. You know, cause I'm also buy air range for my kids. I don't buy air range for myself. You know, when I came home from jail, I say I was broke, so I wasn't really able to do what I really, you know what I'm saying, wanted to do for my kid, for my for my babies and shit. But you know, I motherfucking, I motherfucking, uh, fuck I'm about to say. I motherfucking, you know what I'm saying, spent 300 on some air rings for baby Maya. You know, bought Chink Chink, bought Chink Chink a, uh, a new jacket, you know what I'm saying? And, you know, I did what I did coming home. I was flipping, I, I, be, I be flipping iPhones. I flip iPhones, you know what I'm saying? Like when I'm down on my dick, you know what I'm saying? I flip an iPhone, you know what I mean? I flip an iPhone, four, five, four, five hundred dollars, flip an iPhone. Like, that's what I be doing, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Till I run my money up or I be fucking with the casino and shit, you know what I'm saying? Like that's really what I've been doing since I came home from jail, you know what I'm saying? Um, I made $260 off YouTube, uh, my YouTube check this month was 260. So, you know, I wasn't really no money and shit like that. So, you know what I'm saying? I, I be flipping them iPhones, man. That's really what I do. I flip them 13s, them 13s and them 14s. That's what I do. 13, 13 Pro Max, 128 gigabyte, and, and, and the 14, the 14 uh, 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 Pro, the 14 Pro. You know what I'm saying? 14 Pro cheaper than the 13 Pro Max, but. I still get make four, four, five hundred of them bitches. You know what I'm saying? But once I motherfucking, you know, get back on my shit all the way, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, shit real. <laughs> shit gonna get real. Ask my N.O. niggas, they'll let you know how.
I'm back, y'all. I am back. My motherfucking daughter FaceTiming me and shit. Fuck my damn lot. Fuck my damn shit up. She knew what she was doing. After she just kirked out on me, she want to FaceTime me. After she just kirked out. Girl be tripping. The fuck? The fuck? The fuck? The fuck? The fuck? But I'm back, though. I'm back, though. We lost like 23, 24 people. You know what I'm saying? Them be the people that I guess know that I ain't about to come back or don't know if I'm gonna come back. I don't fucking know. My nigga Zulu, Zulu just called my phone too. My nigga Zulu. That third life, I'm about that. Close range, I pop some. Talking money, that's my lane. No boy broke, tell him stop fronting. Ride around with that pistol on me. Smoke one for my nigga. Oh, go hard for OG Fresh. Hit me every day when I was on the road. I'm a hundred nigga, you ain't got like, still got my AK. Free boot, free beat jizzle. Look, cutting dude, the big cutting fist. Hey y'all, hold on. I'm gonna try to see if my father not get a little duty ass on the on the. Now, hold on, y'all. Hold on, right quick. I ain't going nowhere. I'm about to just text somebody. Ooh, ooh, show you right. Ooh, ooh, ooh. Where everybody at? Where we at? Where you at? Where you at? Talk to me. Talk to me. Talk to me, man. Where you at? For shit show, got Rod in here for shit show. Shout out my nigga Rod, man. Real supporter, man. Real supporter. Shout out to my nigga Rod, man. Uh, uh. Shout out my nigga Shells, man. Long time no talk to my nigga. What's good, baby? Oh. Uh, shit. The IG. The IG, the Facebook, or the email. Like, the Facebook, Boss Man Vlogs. I don't post nothing on that bitch. I just use that motherfucker for emails. The IG is underscore boss man vlogs. And the Gmail is boss boss man wheezy ten 
at gmail b o s s m a n w e e z y one zero at gmail. Let me see. My nigga Shells, man. Last time, hey, last time I was watching Shells, that nigga was in my fucking shooting my. He was in playing basketball and shit. I ain't my fucking seen my nigga Shells in a minute, man. Playing basketball and shit, letting niggas know like, yeah, nigga, I was on the mixtapes with these niggas. Like, yeah, man, shout out my nigga Shells, man. Uh, B O S S M A N. W E E Z Y one zero at, at, at gmail.com. Man, David Kelly, shout out David, man, shout out David, man. Y'all niggas know what's up with me, man. Y'all know what's good. That nigga Shells used to set that motherfucking camera up and motherfucking pop them threes. That's how this nigga really be playing ball. Watching the nigga on the IG and shit. Mm. You got anything on that piff? Nah. Already, already, shells, already, shells. Just tap in me. Hey, when you when you see I'm not on this bitch, just tap in with me, brother. You heard? Like, just tap in when you see I ain't on this bitch. Just tap in with me. I'll get right back to you. Zulu say you got anything on that piff. No, I don't got no music on no platform. Only music I got, uh, Zulu, is, is on YouTube. I don't even know how to put music on that piff. I ain't gonna hold you. I thought I don't even know you like I don't, I'm tripping. I don't, I don't know how to put music on that piff. I don't know how to put music on nothing. The internet shit wasn't normal when I was a rapper. Put it like that. When I was a rapper, all of these all of these resources that we got now, we did not have. Man, everything been good. Everything been good, David. Man, you know, same old, same old. Same shit, different turly, you heard? I came on here in the beginning, basically speaking on mental health and shit. You know what I'm saying? S speaking on mental health. But you know everything, you know nigga living, man. Nigga living life, you heard? That motherfucker, that motherfucking like I'm, I'm trying to figure out why the fuck does this shit smell so good though? Like, god damn, that shit boofing all the way downstairs. That shit boofing downstairs. Oh wait. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I got that shit. That shit done now. You know, we done. We done. We done. I'm about to literally uh cook the motherfucking steak. Not cook the steak, but just heat it up. You know what I'm saying? Just heat it up a little bit. Just a little bit for like about five seconds. Well, maybe about one, two minutes. You know what I'm saying? I'm Saint Say always cooking. You already know. You know what I'm saying? What we doing? Uh. You know what I'm saying? Cause it's good old steak. <laughs> Every time I'm in the kitchen, you in the kitchen. In the goddamn refrigerator. Eating up all the food. All the chicken. All the collard greens. All the whole mold. I like some of them chillings. I eat pig feet. <laughs> Now, son, didn't I tell you to take out the trash last night? <laughs> I wake you up with a left hook and make you take out the trash. <laughs> I, 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 I. 
What? What you doing? We ain't got no milk. You better put some water on that damn shit. <laughs> oh, man. You heard. T said cooking with balls, man. Yeah, you know, man, it's a little something, something shot. You see, I ain't really doing it. I'm just trying, you know what I'm saying, wake up. Just wake up the steak. You know what I'm saying? I cook my shit. I'm a medium red nigga, man. But then, you know, sometimes shit be a little different. You know, everybody don't like their shit medium red. Yeah, you know I man. So, you know, I probably made this shit well done. I don't know. Me and Cat, I'm, you know, I'm cast iron shorty, so I be just having fun. Listen, I'm telling y'all, I'm about to, you know what I'm saying? I'm about to get the catering junk together, get this food together, you know what I mean? Because motherfuckers made me. Motherfuckers put me on. Shit. Shit crazy to me, but fucker be saying a lot of crazy shit about me, man. That shit be tripping me out. I ain't gonna hold you, man. I'm gonna be saying a lot of crazy shit about me. My success in life is all based off another person. Listen, if my father not telling me that, ain't no nigga say that to me. I'm gonna tell y'all niggas some real shit. My father, my father, the only nigga that can say he made me. He put me on. It's the only nigga that can say that. Can't no other nigga say that. No other man on earth say he put me on. You know what I'm saying? No other man on earth can say they put me on. My father, the only nigga that 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 can be like, nah, nigga, I did this, I did that. Nah, you ain't get that. You ain't buy that. I bought that. My father, the only nigga that can say that, bro. I don't know what the fuck be going on. People, people thinking, what the fuck is y'all wrong with y'all niggas? But then motherfuckers be forgetting how real of a nigga I am. You feel me? They be forgetting how real of a nigga I am. Like, I be scared to tell the truth. You know what I'm saying? I don't be scared to tell no fucking truth, nigga. My father is my biggest motherfucking supporter and my biggest hater. Straight like that. My father is my biggest supporter and my biggest hater. No cap. No cap. No cap. Nigga be tripping. Nah, I just got I just happen to have a father that got money. That ain't real talk. I just happen to have a father that got money. You know, he semi-love me, you know. He don't never like my situations, but he semi-love me. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Hey, can't nobody say they done done, done something for me or they the reason of anything. Nigga, I'm the reason my shit. Nigga, crazy. What we talking about? Hey, Stink! Come watch this. Come watch this pot so I can make this macaroni, huh? You know I ain't washing no dishes. Don't wash that pot for me. Kenneth, 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 man, appreciate it, man. Appreciate it, man. For sure. Mm. So you still got the dogs. I just uh I just got three. I, I got three dogs. I got Meech, Zeus, and Bambi. I got three dogs. Bambi's been a disappointment two times in a row. But Bambi's so fucking big, nigga can't even get nigga nigga is it's not gonna be easy to get rid of the bitch. Matter of fact, I might make a video. 
for real, for real, probably trying to sell Bambi and try to sell uh, Meech. Probably sell Bambi for $500. You know what I'm saying? Nigga had Bambi for 500 I don't know. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, you know, we'll see how it play out for nigga Warner. But I don't. I don't, I don't know. I really just want my fucking Frenchies. I ain't gonna lie. Like, I don't. I don't like. As far as like, I just want Frenchies. I don't really want other dogs. Like I don't want. I want I want one big dog that's a god dog, but then as far as the business shit, I just want Frenchies. I don't I don't want no, I don't want no fucking uh bullies. I don't want no bullies. I just want all I just want Frenchies. If I could have ten Frenchies, and I could just create them a little house and do this and do that with them, I'm cool with that. I just take I take that. I don't I don't I don't I don't I honestly I don't want to go to having nine, ten dogs, ten big dogs ever again. You know what I'm saying? Like I don't want to go to having nine, ten big dogs again. I'm gonna just go back to you know what I wanted to do afterwards. So after I had all of those big dogs, I wanted to get Frenchies and I bought a Frenchie. I'm gonna just do that shit all over, like. I'm going to buy a Frenchie. Like, Frenchie coming soon. A Frenchie coming soon. No cap. Frenchie coming soon. Frenchie coming soon. I don't want no big dogs no more, though. But a Frenchie is coming soon, definitely. Y'all be on the lookout for a Frenchie. I'll be, I be getting a Frenchie. It's time to get this motherfucking money. I've been, I, I've been, I've been away for too long. I've been away from the money for too long. I've been just through too much stupid shit for too long. It's time to get to this fucking bag. Like, trust me, it's time to get to this bag, nigga. Frenchie on the way, nigga. You heard me, like, yeah, yeah. Frenchie on the way, nigga. <laughs> yeah, that part. You heard me. That part, nigga. Frenchie on the way. Frenchies with a real money. Yeah, you already know. Frenchies with a money. Yeah. Some curry fly. Yeah, I mean, yeah. If I got fluffy, you man, listen. I'm listen. I'm I'm trying to jump into the French game. The same way I jumped into this shit with these bullies. Like I'm I I never wanted to stop breeding dogs. That's never been what I wanted to do, but I was on a run. I was on a run. So I start selling my shit because I wasn't able to come on YouTube and make no fucking money. I start selling my shit. I'm not on a run no more. I'm not on a run no more. I'm about to start. I'm about to start back over on every fucking thing. Only difference is I'm not fucking doing these big ass dogs no more. I'm on the run, my nigga. Like I sold shit, nigga. I told, I told my fucking, I told my nigga Will. I said, man, look, man, come get this nigga Frenchie, man. Man, that nigga Will came through in a clutch, got Frenchie from me. I needed that money. I had to pay lawyers. I needed that money, man. I had to pay lawyers, man. Man, I'm selling shit. Man, you got listen. Man, my man, let me tell you something, man. My connect long time ago, bro. And I ain't gonna say the nigga name because that nigga's still in the streets. But my motherfucking connect. Long time ago, he was like, nigga, we buy all this materialistic shit for when we jammed up. When you in a situation, nigga, sell it. My connect taught me that long time ago, bro. I'm spending all this money on all this shit. Bitch, I'm, I know I'm going to go to jail. Like, y'all understand that. I'm running around this motherfucker. I'm running around, jumping through bushes and all of this big wild shit. I know I'm going to go to jail. Man, nigga, let me hear, man. Come get this dog for me, bro. Come get this dog for me, bro. You heard me? Come get this dog for me, man. Say, bro, I got this dog for this month, bro. What you want to do? Nigga, nigga, come get that bitch. Nigga, I'll sell I'll be selling shit. Niggas just ain't want to come get the big dogs. You know, I never sell Zeus, but I damn sure sell Bammy and Meech. But I never sell Zeus. You know what I'm saying? 
I never sell Zeus. You feel me? Hey, Alex, man, you got, man, and look, I, I, man, look, man, yeah, come through for your boy, man, you feel me? Nigga about to be back on that shit, that's all I'm saying, a nigga about to be back on that shit, I'm about to really be back on that shit, you know what I'm saying, and and it, it, it's about to get real, you know what I'm saying, I'm really about to be back on that shit, a million dollars on the way, man, a million dollars, uh, listen, a million dollars, nigga, we, we gonna be a million up, we gonna be a million up by this time next year. And it's on me. That's on me. I'm standing on that shit. You heard me? I'm standing on that shit. That's on me. That's on me. I'm standing on that shit. You heard me? Fuck that. A million dollars. A million dollars up next motherfucker. This same time next year, I'm going to be a millionaire. Fuck that shit. I ain't going to let nothing or no fucking one get in my way. I let too much shit get in my way. I let myself get in my way. I'm going to be a million up this time next fucking year on my soul, nigga. On my soul. I'm fucking killing shit. I'm doing everything. Fuck it. <laughs> you heard me? Let's go. <laughs> oh, cap, man. We ain't doing none of that motherfucking none of that shit. That, that none of that shit is dead. And I don't even do that New Year shit. So I ain't, I ain't about to be like, it's 2023. I'm going to bigger and better. I ain't, I'm not doing all that shit, nigga. It's another nigga the fuck. It, nigga, 20, 20, it was 22 on a Tuesday and then on a Thursday it was 23. Like, nigga, this is the same shit. Like, you know what I mean? But I just know this, that nigga, I'm fucking about to. I'm about to run it up. I'm about to run it the fuck up. I'm talking about I'm about to do so much shit that I'm a, I'm a, I'm gonna be in the hospital probably two, two two three times a week because I'm not sleeping. I'm grinding so hard. I'm trying to tell y'all niggas, man. I'm like I don't, bro. I'm about to him, man. I'm about to him. Every motherfucker who played with me, bro. Like nigga played with me, bitch ass nigga, bitch ass bitch. You played with me, bro. Anybody who played with me, I'm about to, man, fuck we talking about. Niggas ain't gonna about to beat me up. You know, niggas gonna beat me up. Nigga ain't gonna beat me up. Man, I'm not playing, bro. I'm, about, I'm telling y'all, man, I'm about to get it in. I'm about to get it in, man. I'm doing my catering shit. I'm doing, I'm doing the Frenchies. You know what I'm saying? I'm, I'm doing the dog training shit. You know what I'm saying? I'm doing the YouTube shit. <laughs> hey bro, it's about to be. I'm, I'm about to be motherfucker finessing bitches. I'm about to be finessing bitches. Hey, I'm on all that. I'm trying to do OnlyFans. Bitches want to fuck on OnlyFans. Weezy recorder you. I get. I pay you a certain amount of money. You bust it down on OnlyFans. You don't even gotta fuck me, bitch. I'ma just record. I'm the recorder. Shit. I'm on all that shit. Nigga getting rich. For what? Why not? Why not? I'm trying to get rich. Bitches want to bust it open on OnlyFans. Holla at me. Holla at me. You get a little fee. Don't think you about to be getting fucking three, four thousand dollars and shit like, like that. You know what I'm saying? Shout out Tommy. Tommy, you always so, so low. Don't think you're going to get no three, four thousand because motherfucking porn stars don't be getting paid three, four thousand. Y'all bitches be tripping. But, you know, I pay them off. You know what I mean? I, I break you off something. You ain't nigga not paying you no more than two, three hundred. That's real talk. Motherfucking Porn, porn, stuff, porn companies don't be doing that. Y'all keep that shit on y'all own OnlyFans. But if y'all motherfuckers want to collaborate, I'm telling you, hey, nigga, fuck with me. It's a business. I, I don't know. But I ain't fucking, man. Bitches that got pretty feet, I'm telling you now. I'm paying y'all I'm paying y'all off the rip. Bitches that got real pretty feet, I'm paying y'all off the rip. No cap. Holla at me. 
holler at me. Bitches got pretty feet, holler at me. I'm paying y'all off the rip. Man, we finna run this shit up, man. I'm paying y'all off the rip, and I know what pretty feet look like. Just because your toes is painted don't mean your shit pretty. All right? But I'm just saying. Bitches got pretty feet trying to get on the OnlyFans shit. Holla at me, man. Holla at me. Bossmanweezy10 at gmail.com. And that's 10 as one zero. Underscore Bossman Vlogs on Instagram. Bossman Vlogs on Facebook. I'm running the bag up. The fuck? Let's go. What we doing? <laughs> nigga, I'm type of nigga walk up to a bitch. Hey, listen. Hey, so you know I got I got my own uh porn company together. Woo woo ah, ah, ah. And um, you know, I wanted to, to to know if you know what I'm saying, you would you like to, you know, participate in a video? Why? Why? That's what I go say. Why? What you mean? And, you know, I break the shit down to them, and they be like, they be gonna say yes or no. See, one thing y'all gotta realize, bro, it's more motherfucking men in the world. It's more men in the world than it's women. So, a woman is a woman is always gonna have the upper hand because niggas always talk to bitches. Bitches don't always talk to niggas. Man, listen, you holler at ten bitches a day. Ten bitches a day, seven days a week, right? Excuse me. Ten bitches a day, seven days a week. You're going to have, at the end of the week, at least six bitches. And you're going to be fucking three. So, don't say, don't, 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 don't. I am about to say, don't say no for answer. That's some real, uh, I'm about to be on some real uh, rapist shit. But, nah, listen, man. Tell you, man. <laughs> I'm going ham. I'm not playing. Like, I'm like, I'm telling y'all niggas, man. I'm not going ham. I'm going ham. I'm not playing. A million dollars uh, this time next year, bro. I'm telling you, I'm gonna I'm up. I'm gonna be motherfucking at least three hundred k up. I'm trying to be three hundred k up in about six months. Three hundred k up. I'm trying to make moves, man. I'm not playing. I'm not playing, bro. This joint in here bubbling. Why you ain't tell me? Think you gonna eat a whole steak at one time? Hmm? No. Good life. What's good, baby? 
Hey, I'm gonna leave this live up, but I'm gonna tap in with y'all niggas, man, because my fuss keep calling my phone. So I'm gonna tap in with y'all, man. All right, I'm, I'm, I'm gonna probably go live later on the night. You know what I'm saying? If not, you know what I'm saying? I, I, I'm gonna tap in with y'all tomorrow morning and let y'all see me fucking with the dogs and shit. We're gonna do some dog shit. We're gonna do some dog shit tomorrow, man. You heard? So y'all motherfuckers be safe. Everybody be out. Be safe out there. If you gotta keep your gun, keep your fucking gun. Cause listen, your, the closest motherfuckers to you be the niggas that cross you. You heard me? So yeah. All right, man. I holla at y'all.